Oh, howdy there. So here we are on this old world because we are going to go fetch the blade tongue from fishing in the crimson. So there might be some lag right there because I teleported really far. Oh, is there pirates over here too? I don't even know. Get out of the way. I'm in dire need of some bait. Oh, here we are already. We're already uh, in a crimson area. Not the exact crimson area though because I don't see... Oh, here we go. Here we go. Now we just gotta find some water. Let me get. All right. Yeah, we do. I do have wood on deck. Let's see here. Is this enough water? I feel like there's water somewhere over here. I, I have a feeling that in this world, some area, I made a giant lake of some sort. No, definitely not this way. All right, we're just gonna have to work with what we have. We are just gonna have to work with what we have here. Man, it's really dark. All right, can I not place a torch? There you go. Is there water up here? There is. All right. I need to upgrade my pickaxe like soon. Who the hell? Goddamn gastropod shooting me. Get out of here. Alright. Hopefully I killed him. Yeah, let's connect these two waters. It's really dark. Holy hell. Was it is it always a dark Antaria? I don't remember this. Alright, um We need wood. Cause we're gonna do this. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. Alright, there you go. Whoa! Holy hell, zombies can jump high. Alright, let's do this. Oh my. You need to chill, zombie. Get out of here. Alright. And then now. Oh, here's some water right here. Connect this water. Just gotta get all the waters connected and we're good to go. But yeah, I need to upgrade this pickaxe. Pickaxe. It's not that good anymore. But it's my fisherman pickaxe. It's my beautiful pickaxe. That I use all the time. It's not my good old fisherman. Alright. I think that should be good. I well, no, it's not going to be good. We need to get this water, too. So let me just let me just make a drain that goes straight down right here. And we should be tremendous. There we go. Is it not, like, flooding out? Yeah, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Wait, we got to get, like, right in the middle of it. Yeah, 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 there we go. Bam, that should be good. That should be good. All right, oh, I threw my anchor out. Let's switch to uh, the fishing set. Put that baby on. And let's see if we can get us a blade tongue right here. Oh, 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 we got it. We got it. Oh my god. I fished for a whole goddamn day. And we got it. Holy hell. It's like a 1 in 200 drop chance. And I fished like 500 times. Come on now, game. Don't do this to me. Oh, it's large too. I like it. I like it. Alright, so. We got it. And uh, let's test out. Sorry for your dogs barking. It's like 90 degrees right now and I have the window open. Alright. Oh my god, look at this. Ooh. Fire's like an Ecor stream. Look at that. Oh, dang, it like bounces too. Oh, on hit though, you have to land the hit. All right, I get it, I get it. Oh, that's good, holy hell. That is amazing. All right, so we're going to jump back into our beautiful world. There will be a little fishing montage, but I think I'll cut it short because I am i didn't record the whole entire thing. That was way too long to fish for like, how long is the tour your day? Like 20 minutes? I don't think it's that long, but that still was pretty long. And plus it was, I started at night and I ended at night too. What the heck? All right, so let's reforge this, our beautiful blade tongue. We're no longer going to use the, the ink. Actually, I might find a use for an anchor. I don't know. We'll see. But let's see if we can get, what do I have? Where's the slap hand? Oh, there it is. It is 15% knockback. All right. Uh, Damage. I don't know if we want that. Speed? Eh, that might be kind of good. Lazy. Oh, this is pretty good, too. Hmm. We got a lot of gold. Yeah, I'll take that. I will take superior. 
Not bad. Okay, so I think what we want. I don't know what armor we really want. I think we might go ranger armor. Just because of the bubbles and we got the we got that baby too. So let's open up some crates. I think I'm gonna keep the crimson crates for a decoration because these things are cool. And I probably won't go to the crimson ever again. Just just being uh straight up right there. Alright, let's stand by this guy because I wanna sell stuff. Cause I won't be needing any of that. Right? Definitely not gonna need any of that. Even the splunker potions. Another anchor. No thanks. I mean, I, that's one of, the, one of the weapons I wanted to primarily use. It's not giving me anchors. But uh, it just doesn't do any damage at all. I don't know why it's even a hard mode weapon. Uh, obsidian skin potion. It's one of the cooler weapons, too. I'll sell all of that. I will sell all of that. I'll keep the titanium, though. I might be making stuff out of titanium. Maybe. Tartar sauce. I will sell. Hunter potion. I will sell. Sell. I'll keep that because it's like my primary bait now. Adamantite, holy hell. Dang, do we get 20 gold from that one crate? What the heck? Oh, we got 57 gold in total just from that. All right. Uh, where is... There it is. So I also have a bunch of fish I can sell. Oh, I have this too. I have that too. Here, you want some 53 bass, which is two gold. Holy hell. I didn't think it'd be that much. That's seven gold. We'll sell like half of these, even though I probably won't even use that many. Maybe more than half. We'll go with like something like that. And then I'll sell that. What else do I need to sell? Uh, obsidian skin. All right. Looking good. Looking good. So let's also, we got to put some more gold away. So I don't know if I'm going to make adamantite armor or if I'm going to make the other armor, titanium. I don't know. Let's see right now what we have, which is in this chest. We got a bunch. Oh my God. We got a lot of that, but we also do have a good bit of titanium. Not as much as I want. Hmm. Titanium. Let's look at the range thing. Dang, 23 defense. Look at the difference in defense on the mass for melee. That's crazy. 22. 8. Obviously, it's going to be a little bit smaller. 16. 16% increased range damage. Uh, what about critical strike chance? So, this has higher critical strike chance. I think you want critical strike chance over ranged. I'm pretty sure that's how you want it. So, I might just go with that. And that's just increased damage. Yeah, we'll go Adamantite on this one. Because we just want to fight the Destroyer. And we should be good once we fight him. Uh, so let's make... Can we make a drill? Let's make a drill. No, let's make a... I'll make a pickaxe. Pickaxe are less annoying. Alright. Boom, bada, bing. We got the Cobalt armor. Toxic Heart does a little bit more damage. Our Staunch Bow does some more damage. So, are we going to be fighting the dude are we gonna be what's his name destroyer probably not in this episode because i think i have an idea for what i want to do in this episode but maybe we might give it an attempt if i really want to i'm gonna put the reaver shark away rest in peace you were good you were a good weapon good use to me and i'm gonna put uh this in here put that right there put a little bit closer actually no we'll do that and then i'll put the fish in here so this is what i have in store right here we are going to go underground to the corruption. Should I wait for a quest? No, we still got a while before we get a quest. All right, I'm going to go underground to the corruption. I'm just buff. Because I want to go over there so we can fight the Eater of Worlds. And fighting the Eater of Worlds underground the corruption should allow us to get a bunch of Souls of Night. So we can fight some of those chests. Okie dokie. So we are good to go here. I want to get to the lowest area we can down here, though. Just to make sure we get the Souls of Night. And we're going to try out our new uh, Blade Tongue here. I think this is low enough. But uh, I'll yeah, I'll buff. I'll buff a little bit. Even though he should be pretty easy to kill. Might as well buff. Dang, look at that. Just bounce around on him. Yeah, come right here. Like, Can you come up Can you come up a little bit? No, we're not even giving him like, any Souls of Night. Come on, at least one Soul of Night. We got two of them, like, just in general, I think, from killing monsters. Maybe we do have to get, like, a lot lower. Yeah, hey, he's not dropping a single one. What the heck? What the heck? He didn't drop shit. What is this? That's some hacker bullshit going on right there. He didn't drop a single thing. What the heck? The wiki lied. The wiki goddamn lied to me. Alright, when's if I kill him down here? If you guys drop a soul, then that means... Oh, we got blindfold. Whoa. 
Come on, what? No soul at all. Alright, hold up. Let's drop down even lower. Even lower. Uh oh, we're in an ice cave now. Whatever, still still corruption down here. Alright, let's try uh, let's try again. We got one left. Come on, we're deep as hell right now, dude. I'm deep as hell. Something. Anything? What the heck? Whoever put that on the goddamn wiki is an asshole. What the heck? This is a waste of time. I gathered like 30 chunks for this or however many. Is it 30 on? No. Get out of here. Oh, cool. We got an Amarok. Whoa, we got a frozen key. <laughs> Alright, I see some use in uh, fighting the Eater of Worlds. Dang, that was actually pretty cool. Is there anything like crazy special that I want? Not really. Dang, we got frozen key and an Amarok. That's kind of crazy. What the hell? I don't know if you guys have heard that. Goddamn horn honking outside. Alright. Let's finish up this episode since uh, whoever put down the wiki was a straight up liar. That or I'm not deep enough. But I got two souls at night. What the heck? I got two souls of night just like farming in general. Alright. Whatever. We're going to use this frozen key at the dungeon since we're like right here. I think. Yeah, we're really close. Uh, And we'll get... We'll get the Frost Hydra because that's some extra DPS. We're going to need like all the extra DPS we can accumulate as our fishing playthrough character because we don't run into DPS. We don't get like DPS from uh, having high fishing power, sadly. But, uh, holy hell, that is the farthest fall. Now, oh my god, where's the key at? Where's the, where's the snow one? I think it's down. It's down this direction, I believe. Get the hell out of here. We don't gotta deal with any like super, super skeletons down here, which I still think the dungeon is like one of the hardest areas once you get once you get into uh, extra mode. But uh, yeah, ah, what's this? This is the hollowed one. I don't remember. The hollowed one drops the rainbow gun, which we might use in this playthrough. I don't know. I never find myself using like any weapons from here. That is, oh, that's the scourge of the. Oh, I'm surprised we didn't get the key for this. What the heck? How'd I get the frozen key? Now I'm getting, I've been getting the frozen key a lot. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna lie here. I got it in the summoner playthrough, and I got it in this playthrough like really quickly. Summoner one, I kind of grinded out, grinded out, but this one, I was just fighting him, trying to get souls at night, and he's just like, hey, you want some free goods? Here you go. But I don't know. Have we ever even found the ice chest down here? I feel like we haven't. Come on, it's gotta be around here somewhere. It's gotta be around here. Up here, it has to be. I feel it. Oh, yes. I felt it right. Oh, you can't open them until Plantera. God damn it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.